Hello, y'all. Welcome to Life Happens by the Mob. This is your all favorite mother trucker, Michaela. And anyway, I am sitting here in Springfield at the Millennium. I just repowered a load that's going on to PA. As y'all know, I do not do the Northeast. No thank you. No way. No how. I like my Western Regional. And my students in there doing his laundry, Jawan, and he is a total rock star, y'all. And anyway, um, I got to give a shout out to a company. We're not allowed to say their name, but there's a certain blueberry company in Oregon. Y'all were awesome. I mean, they gave us gift bags. They gave us deals of blueberries. You know, little uh, cartons of blueberries. I mean, it was awesome. And the gift bags came a little poem. Oh, shit. I had that poem set aside. I got it somewhere. It was really, really awesome, y'all. I mean, I wish all of our shippers and receivers were like this. And they appreciate the hard work we do. But, unfortunately, we're not in that business of anyone appreciating us. Even though no one in this country could do anything without a trucker. They couldn't get dressed. They couldn't put their makeup on could spray their lady parts to make them smell presentable, nothing. So, anyway, y'all, um, I am sitting here, and I am fixing to go up to Colorado. I'm doing a repower for another load, and then from there, I'm not quite sure where we're going. The countdown to me being off and the end of my lease is just clicking away. Um, I have, like, 29 days left. Because I stand on my lease until the 5th, so. And I'll do a video all on the end of the lease. Um, and what it's like to finish your lease and so forth. And the cost involved and so on. And when I get back, I actually get to pick whatever truck's out here. But it's only going to be for a short-term lease. Because the lease program, lease purchase program is coming back. And I will be purchasing me a truck. Not sure if I'm going to purchase a Freightliner or Cascadia. Um, from what I understood from talking to Success Leasing, is that first it's only going to be the Cascadias on the lease purchase program. They might bring the um, Peterbilts it's also, but you can't get a Peterbilt until next year because this is for the 2024 trucks. And they start relieving, releasing the Cascadias in December so I imagine that's when the purchase program will officially kick off but they're making an announcement in September sometime with the outline of the new program so real excited about that looking forward to getting my own truck little nervous about that upcoming gastric sleeve surgery I'm going to be starting a new channel separate from this one and um, I think I'm going to take the name Life Happens to the Mile by the mile over that channel and I'm going to go back to being I'll be a mother trucker or, some, or a Miss Mother Trucker or you know Life is a Mother Trucker. I don't know. We'll figure something out. But I'm going to just kind of keep this more trucking y'all get to follow my journey but you know, I'm just going to kind of separate the channels. Because not everyone wants to hear about my weight loss. Not everyone wants to hear what's going on with that. And, um, you know, there's just so many things going on in trucking alone. So, anyway, the lease program is officially coming back. I had to call and check after another YouTuber blurted it out. Um, so, I went ahead and I... I fact checked but and that's what all y'all should do just because someone's on youtube doesn't mean they know what the hell they're talking about it just means they know how to upload a video so anyway guys and welcome all you new people at prime that i've gotten to meet awesome sauce um hope everyone's having a good time and i will get back with y'all a little bit later um take care and talk to you later bye bye